Uh, here we are in the, the, the office of the great revolutionary Leon Trotsky, where he was assassinated at 20, 20 August of 1940 by a hangman of Stalin. Uh, on this table, he succeeded, or he was writing one of his main uh, political and historical works that was the biography of Stalin. Contrary to what many people believe, he had no interest in writing this book. His main interest was in finishing the biography of Lenin, of which he had previously done his youth, the youth of, of Lenin. But for economical reason, for the scarcity in which was leaving the family here, he ac accepted the, the offer, the demand of Harper Brothers, who was supposed to pay a, a good amount of dollars for, for that work. There, no, there is no doubt that uh, the reali realization of this biography uh, accelerated the assassination of Leon Trotsky because Stalin uh, was really afraid and didn't want that this work came out. And he par partially succeeded in that uh, purpose um, because uh, Trotsky was not able to finish uh, all the, to see the, the, the end of the publication of this book who was uh, in charge to, to a American translator, Malamut, who didn't please very much to Trotsky, but finally he accepted his in the intervention of Malamut. But after the assassination of Trotsky, the, the editorial board even charged, charged Malamut to, to do the edition work of that, that biography. And that's where, where really Malamut mutilated, uh, nearly destroyed this, this work. A great part of the material was not included in the publication, and uh, Malamud uh, used the, this, uh, this work to introduce a lot of personal annotation of himself. The publication of the book was delayed by the American government for several years, because at that time there was um, a very friendly relation with Russia, Roosevelt and Stalin. There was, in, uh, there was a honeymoon <laughs> between the States and uh, the Soviet Union. But finally it was published. It's a, a book of uh, nearly 500 pages. But uh, it was a mutilated book. It was really, uh, um, uh, it was not really the, the, the complete uh, work of Leon Trotsky. It's important to mention that this book was written in the last uh, stage of Trotsky life when he has the, the most um, maturity in his political thinking and capacity of Marxist analysis. And this book is of, should be of great interest, and, but it was so until our friends of, of England, of, of Marxist uh, tendency, uh, took in their hands the, the, great, uh, the, the great task of achievement of that book, 
who take them more than 10 years of very hard years work. First, they have to collect from the Harvard archives all the material that was uh, excluded by the, the mediocrity of Malamut. And uh, finally, uh, also with the help of our Marxist, uh, Britannic Marxist Alan Woods, all this work was uh, or ordained uh, and uh, um, put in in in, log in, in, or in political order according to the ideas that should uh, have has has been those of Leon Trotsky, and actually, finally, we have the the, the this this book published, who has more than thousand pages, and it's a great achievement, yes. This book uh, can be considered one of the master works of Trotsky, which uh, could be on the side of my life and the history of the Russian Revolution and with Stalin. So it was really it's a great achievement. I congratulate those cameras who could do this marvelous and important work achievement.